Hello loves and welcome back to my channel. My name is Angelique if you are new here and today is very very exciting. We are expanding our garden. We're working on a few other home projects today but this morning we went to Home Depot. Now that we're home we just landscaped some of our backyard making it all look so pretty. It's coming together very very nicely. Um, sorry, I'm out of breath. We're doing like a million things. But Sawyer's gonna start cutting the wood. He's just measuring it all right now, making sure everything's good. And then over the next week, I can kind of do what you guys already saw. Um, <laughs> but sand and paint and do all of that and expand our garden. Um, I've been really, really enjoying this process, mainly because this is a part of our house that we get to do on our own. This is our renovation. It wasn't done when we moved in. So the backyard has been a ongoing project. So this garden was something that I didn't expect to do, but during quarantine, <laughs> we had all this free time, and so it's been really, really fun. So with all that being said, let's go outside, watch Sawyer cut some wood, <laughs> and start expanding our garden. P.S. I love how I did that intro with my garden gloves on. It's love of mine Come sing with me Good morning. We are starting our day off bright and early at the good old Home Depot. Um, we made the decision last night, well actually a few days ago, to expand our garden. Uh, we're very, very excited about it. We just realized how much we love it and we just feel like it needs to be bigger so that way I can plant more plants. So that's what we're going to be working on. So we came to the Home Depot. Home Depot. Twenty-one pieces of wood later. Start round two of the garden. I think Home Depot is becoming my <laughs> second home. We're up to something. That was a huge run to Home Depot. We got wood for boxes. Um, we're also running two projects at once. Um, we're expanding the garden, which is exciting, as well as working on the landscaping in the backyard. So. Um, got a little bit of things for both. Um, anyways, big, big Home Depot run. We should be good for a while now. <laughs> he is currently carrying all 21 pieces of wood in by himself. Woo! <laughs> show him all the rocks. Yeah. And the rocks. It's 25 bags of rocks. <laughs> Okay, so it's been a really, really long day, but we're, we're still going at it. So Sawyer's gonna try to knock out these next three garden boxes. I have faith in him. Um, yeah, I love you, boo, thanks. Yeah, if I can do it, and man. I think you can, it's cut. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> three more garden, well, I can't even speak, wow, okay. Well, I'm glad you're not building them. Yeah, he's gonna build them now. Okay. That's the montage. Two minutes. That's it? 22 minutes. Wow, we're getting better at this. You're getting better at this. <laughs> hey, I'm getting better at gardening. I built the box 22 minutes. Yay, first box. Yay. All done. Oh, I don't want to get splinter. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's not, not sanded. Oh, good job, boo. Thanks, you want to help me carry it over here? Right. Yeah, yeah, cool. It's a box. Cute. So the space behind our shed is a little bit more narrow. Oh, we haven't taken them back there to show what we're doing. Um, it's a little more narrow. I'll go show you guys in a second. So we made the boxes a little bit more narrow, so it's gonna be perfect for like watermelon or things that just need more room. I can so, carry one back there. No, it's fine. Do you care to just take the camera back there? All right, so this is our current garden. Um, I'm loving it so much and things are already growing and I've already realized that we're gonna quickly run out of space. So we decided. Part two. To expand. So we're gonna come back here. We're gonna put one box this way and then put two boxes here. And then we thought about maybe putting a baby box on the end to cap it um, and kind of- And maybe a fountain right there. Yeah, something, something. we're gonna, we're just really excited because this part of our yard 
we don't use as well. Yeah, and we'll keep the white going, keep the steps going. So the steps will go in, and then the steps will go right, and it'll go all the way. So it'll be like an intersection, kind of like there, but it'll actually go somewhere. We're very excited. I think yeah. it'll make great use, and it'll look so cute. Okay, back to building boxes. <laughs> Pants, are you excited for a bigger garden? Ollie, bigger garden? Hi, buddy. That's don't jump up. And just like that, he's building technically box number five. Yeah. How crazy is that? Five garden yeah. boxes. I, I didn't know. I, I, didn't. I see what Jesus was on about. Oh, oh, oh. He was a carpenter. I know. I, I mean, this Did is... Did you just compare yourself to Jesus? No. <laughs> I drew acknowledgement to one of his hobbies. That's that is sick. Fair. Very cool. Yeah. I get it. Yeah, I like gardening now, so who would have ever thought? You can like carpentry and not Jesus. Oh. Yeah. Whatever. Go build a I, I choose to like Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> All right, oh lord! Oh, I need those pieces. Of wood. I feel like you guys are seeing a I, lot more. I've been working like so, yeah. Since I stopped vlogging, I've just become myself. I feel, I feel like you guys are seeing a lot more of our uh, our relationship and personalities in these garden vlogs. I find them hilarious. Okay, Oliver, <laughs> what are you doing? How do you have a pile of clothes on you? Good morning. It's about 8.30 a.m. <laughs> uh, last night Sawyer finished the second box and then our drill died. So this morning he's finishing the third. Uh, okay, get to work, hon. I'm going to go take care of this mop. All right, show us your first strawberry. We got a berry. Look at, look how cute. It's, it's starting to get the colors, another too. Another pink. It's a little. <laughs> how cool is that? Then the peppers. Orange one coming in. And that damn watermelon. Oh, so cute. Yep. Nice and little. Yep. No, same that wonky leg, but it works, I promise. We have three more garden boxes. Like my other photo. <laughs> Okay, all three of my garden boxes are done and built, so we're gonna go ahead and sand them real quick. And honestly, the sanding process should go so much quicker this time because of the saw we used. Um, it was so much straighter and more even, and so it should just be to get off any of the splinter part of the wood, anything that might poke me, and just smooth it out. So let's quickly get working on that. This time, I'm not starting without my safety glasses on so I don't get sawdust in my eye again. <laughs> Learn from the last one. One box done. Whew. On to box number two. All right, we've made it to the third and final box. <laughs> this time sanding is going by much quicker, so let's just get it done. Okay, the third box is done. Oh, I'm exhausted. Whew. Okay guys, it's time to start painting the three more additions. So I just have my outdoor paint, the same as I used last time, and just gonna see how far I can get before I lose all sunlight. It's like 5.30 now, um, so wish me luck. <laughs> I always like to paint at night, and it always throws off my schedule, but one day I will learn. Lovely. I was just working on this side. Here, I'll show you. Boom. I was working on the second side of the box, first box, and I feel raindrops, so I feel like I should quickly get the paint and back, cover it. Okay, so I feel like I should quickly move all this into the underneath the covered area um, and hope that this box is dry enough. Oh gosh. Oh, I hope it doesn't dump. Okay, <laughs> let's move. 
hopefully I pass this quick so I can continue. If not, I guess that's all I got done, which was nothing. <laughs> okay, it's officially raining. Um, it looks like it might clear up, but now the boxes are wet. So I feel like I'll just need to let it dry overnight and then come out here first thing in the morning and try to get as much done as possible. Anyways, I guess that's it for tonight. <laughs> I'm gonna quickly spray my vegetables with my neem oil because I see a pepper that's being attacked um, and I don't want to lose all the new buds. So I'm gonna go spray it for some bugs and then I'm gonna go shower because I did way too much outside. I'm a dirty, dirty, sweaty mess. I'm gross. Okay, good night. See you tomorrow when we paint these boxes. <laughs> it's Tuesday at 12.30. You're a lazy bum. And you're a lazy bum. I know, it's really hot outside. Okay, so Sawyer so woke up early and finished box one for me. I just finished box two, so now we're gonna get box three done, let that dry, and go in for the second coat. Let, let's see what he just did. Uh, see that paint tray? See, the, see the paw the, print in it? <laughs> see the footprint? Well, good morning. We're painting boxes. And then Hitch rubbed up against it. So, oh, is he in bed with the paint? Oh, God. All the boxes are painted with their first coat. I'm gonna go ahead and do the second coat because it's gonna look a lot like this, <laughs> except take me some more time. So I'll be back when the second coat is done. At the end of this, I'll be able to do uh, full-on landscaping. Anybody in Hawaii need some uh, garden boxes and landscaping done? Hit me up. <laughs> I'm now ready, even though the lighting's horrible and you can't tell. Um, I showered because I was so sweaty after painting, even though it doesn't matter because I'm coming outside. Again, get my work gloves on. We finished the boxes, two coats done, so that's good. Um, I'm gonna go back into this corner right over here and I have to clean out this area so our fence line is cinder blocks I know that sounds so weird but um, that's how the fence was done um, at the bottom it's all cinder blocks so the holes are full of a bunch of random stuff so I'm gonna scrape everything out and clean out this dirt and then I have to move these rocks as well because we're putting in the white rocks so it's just gonna be a big cleanup day. I'm gonna see how far I can get before I just pass out from heat exhaustion because it is so hot outside. But um, I wanna get out here and start making progress so we can get those boxes off the grass so we don't kill our grass. So anyways, let's start cleaning up the second part of our garden. See, this is what I'm talking about. All this is filled with grossness and then we have all this dirt that needs to be raked out and this hole area that's full of leaves and just old grass so that is the plan I'm also gonna grab the shop back because I feel like I can just get in there and suck most of that out let me see about that problem is we used to have a big tree back here and it used to sprout like all these little weeds so I wanted to be careful when I was just raking all of it around because there's probably just some seeds sitting over here so anyways um I'll probably get a trash bag I cleared out all this as well as all those little spots in the cinder blocks and it looks so much better. I wish I would have thought of the shop back before I did this other side of the garden so I could really clean it out before. Um, oh well. <laughs> Anyways, this looks so much better. Um, I even cleaned up this side of the uh, yard as well. So that took me some time. So now I'm just trying to figure out this gray rock situation. I know technically, I should remove all the gray rocks to do it properly and relay the um, weed protector, like the weed fabric. It's just gonna be really heavy and a lot of work, but I know it's the right way to do it and I kinda just wanna do it right because it kinda feels like so many times this backyard has kinda been uh, half done, if you know what I'm saying. So I kinda just wanna take the time and do it right and properly so we don't have to do it again. <laughs> 
um, but I am not looking forward to shoveling all this gray rock into bags. No, I'm not. Not at all. One bag done. To be completely honest, some of these up in here, I might just push over on this side. Back there, I just have to rake most of it up because of all the seeds that fall in that area. But holy crap, rocks are heavier than dirt. So out of breath. Um, the rocks have been, I can't even speak, oh my gosh. Okay, the rocks have been bagged. I'm just going to level this out. I did leave some of the rocks, like it's not life or death. So I'm going to level this. I'm also gonna cut the uh, landscape barrier because there's one right here. So that way I can level it and then we'll be good. Oh, this poor shed. Um, but at least this will be level and then tomorrow I can do the weed material, fabric, and then we can put down the garden beds and get them off the grass. Yay, oh, it's coming along so nicely. Okay, let me cut this. Everything is pretty much level. I'll have Sawyer come look at it and see if he see something that I missed, but holy crap, that is a big difference. It's gonna look so much better. To be honest, this space was never gonna be used. We had no use for it besides like storing our wheelbarrow. So this will be so much better. And yeah, oh my gosh, I'm excited to see what it looks like when it's all done. Uh, but yeah, we're level, cool, moving on. Okay, what do you think? Whoa, it looks great. Crazy. Pretty level, huh? All right, guys, honestly, that's it for tonight. I am pooped. I'm gonna go shower. I've never showered so much. <laughs> I've done so much yard work, I end up showering so much. Looks great. <laughs> Three times a day. <laughs> okay, I lied, we're not done yet. Okay, so we, uh, we attempted to spray our boxes and now this is full paint, so I'm gonna paint the back side of the shed because why not? Now I'm done for the day. We just painted the side of the shed. We're just waiting for it to dry. Um, obviously it'll dry overnight, and then tomorrow we will deal with the rest of this, but gosh, that was a long day of work. I have dirt everywhere. It's now officially time for me to go shower. <sighs> I feel like that's what I say at the end of every day in these videos, but my gosh, this is a lot of work and it's so hot outside, so yeah. All right. Yesterday I wore a tank top and I got a gnarly tan line. So today it's a swimsuit top. I learned my lesson. Good morning. <laughs> It is kind of awkward lighting, but sorry, it's a really awkward corner. I'm gonna be spending all day out here. I just finished leveling, redoing the lock rocks again, making sure it's all good. And I'm gonna lay out the weed fabric. Got my box cutters and my little staples. You're so cute. I know, right? <laughs> I think we are now pros at this. You are. Um, I am. And the your channel, because I'm not. <laughs> I'm in air conditioning. I hurt my back, guys. Yeah, he did. He was lifting something for me and hurt his back. So it's all me on this one. I'm calling my mom over, and she's going to help me carry the boxes over and lay out all the stuff. So let's get started and get this weed, oh, I can't even speak, this weed fabric out. And yeah, okay. The weed liner is down. I'm gonna head to the hardware store and get more walking stones or stepping stones and more white rocks. And then we are in business, guys. So we have a neighbor who plays live music. That's cool. Um, don't know where he came from. It's a new addition. But anyways, just got back from the hardware store. They only had the rocks. They didn't have like the stepping stones. So gonna have to find those. I feel like every time I need something to like finish a project. My mom is here for reinforcements. So we're gonna carry in those uh, white boxes and at least get them off the grass and then probably head to another hardware store. The 
boxes are now in. They look so good. So my mom and I are gonna go try two more hardware stores to see if we can find the pavers. I just find it so ironic the one time I need them um, is the time they're out. Normally there's a huge pile there. Um, so anyways, let's go find some stepping stones. Whoa, okay. These bags are in a real inconvenient spot. Um, we are back from the hardware store. We found the stones and some garden soil. Wow, garden soil. So we're just gonna bring that back and then we'll place them. Ollie, what are you doing? Hi, buddy. Hi, bud. Okay, so we just finished putting in the stepping stones. They look so good. I think it's time that we put in the rocks. Oh, I'm happy. You guys have no idea how much better this makes this space. Okay, it's time to do the marble chips. Nice way to try to get me to film. <laughs> no, everything looks so good. I'm just putting in the last little bit and I might just touch up some of these spots over here since we have an extra bag of rocks. But looks good. who would have ever thought we'd had this big garden? I never thought that. When I thought of this part with the boxes, I was like, that's it. Then this will be whatever. And now like, this is incredible. Here, hold on, let me show you. So coming in. Oh, what's that? I think I'll take a left and go over here. You got a big L-shaped garden. How cool is this? I'm so excited. And I have lavender to put in here. I love you. <laughs> I love you. Yeah. Lavender? Hey, guy, little lizard, I'm giving you lavender, okay? Lavender. What is there? Watermelon is a key. Those are where their vines can we'll be able to eventually. We'll see. Oh. I don't know. <laughs> I haven't gotten that far. That uh, yeah. Big Looks day. Really Big day. Someone give this girl a home makeover show. Let right? me just boss her out and tell her what looks cool. Just kidding. <laughs> but seriously, you should. <laughs> This is huge. This is the first thing we're ever harvesting yeah. ever in our garden. We're harvesting our first strawberry. Guys, I got any little fiskers. Is that how you say it? Yes. So. All right. Fiskars. Fiskars. Let's go harvest this okay. thing. Okay. How do I? Okay. Come on, Ollie. Come on. After you, buddy. Strawberry field. Ready, pants? We're gonna pick our first strawberry. This is a big day. Okay. Do I just pour it? Okay, here's our strawberry. It's all ripe. So cute. Okay, go ahead and pick it. Okay. Oh my gosh. This is our first strawberry. I probably waited one day too long learning over here. But how wow. cute. We did That's this. Awesome. Should we go wash it and eat it? I guess so. I guess it's what we do. All right. Pants. Oliver. Ollie. Yes, that's a lot of This is our first strawberry. Don't eat it. You did this. You can lick it. It's yours too. Good job, bud. <laughs> okay. We can't let him get too dusty. All right, let's go wash it. I need my cutting board. This is so cool. <laughs> Do you want a bite? A little smaller than that. I'm not a big strawberry fan, I don't think. Cheers. Cheers. Wow. Oh, that's better than, that's good. That tastes like, a, that's our strawberry. That tastes so good. Yeah, that tastes really good. We waited one day too long, but. You're learning. Wow. Oh, this is fun. This is cool. You guys should start a garden. I never knew what it was like to go to camera stores with me until I started coming to the nursery with Anjali. We bought a pomegranate tree, a fig tree, and like 10 pots. 
success.